I'm Dr. Jim Kirkconnell of Bellevue Eye Care Center in Nashville, Tennessee. A LASIK is a very popular procedure today. Uh, I have worked at a laser center. And you can't really talk about whether LASIK is a safe procedure without talking about how it's done. Uh, the way that it's done is either a, a blade, which is a disposable microkeratome, is, is run across the cornea to create a flap, or uh, some doctors actually have a separate laser that create the flap, and uh, the uh, flap is lifted out of the way, and then energy is uh, placed on the cornea to change its shape, and then the flap is laid back down. Uh, within a day, uh, the flap really uh, is fairly stable. Within a week, it's, it's really stable. Um, all the consequences with the LASIK revolve around the flap. You can have um, a foreign body be underneath the flap that uh, gets in there in the first day of uh, post-op when you're just in the environment and it works its way under. Uh, the thing that we don't like to see is, is uh, called DLK, where uh, you have epithelial cells which grow from the edge. Uh, that uh, All these things are managed. They're managed either uh, by uh, giving someone more eye drops, which are typically a steroid drop, to calm it down. Or uh, if you have something which uh, is uh, growing uh, underneath that is not responding, you can lift the flap and scrape it. Uh, the same thing is done for a, a foreign body that's under there that uh, you don't want. You have to lift the flap and uh, take it off. And then uh, what happens is when you put the flap back down, you're effectively starting over again as far as your post-op care. Uh, post-op care is uh, usually the, the next day, a week later, and a month later if there's no complications at all. Um, there are very, very few cases of someone actually losing their vision with LASIK. Um, it's extremely rare. Uh, you do have situations where someone is not happy with their vision after they go through the um, healing time. The healing time is basically something that uh, takes one month per doctor of correction that's done. So if you are minus three, then it's three months. And then you want to see that your vision is stable for a certain period of time. If you're not happy with your vision, then you have something done which is called an enhancement, which means you have it done again, and the surgeon is able to uh, lift the flap with an instrument, and then you, you have it done again. Um, something that's very uh, rare, once again, is to have uh, somebody, somebody actually uh, lose an eye. I, I really don't think that's happened three times in the U.S. that they've, someone has actually lost an eye from LASIK. Uh, the, the thing that you can do to um, help yourself is to know that the surgeon has done at least uh, 50 eyes, if not a thousand eyes, uh, you go to a reputable surgeon and that you keep uh, your side of the bargain, which is that you keep your follow-ups, uh, it's very important that you use the medications as you're asked to and that you use a lot of lubrication for particularly the first three weeks because it, uh, your eye will not heal unless your eye is moist.